Hi, and welcome to another Type with Me. In this week's episode, I want to talk about ArxJS first value from and last value from. So, with first value from within ArxJS, we can very easily grab the first value from a um, stream, right? And with that, we can do that just by here executing interval and value from. If I then now do dno run index dot yes, you'll see that he grabs rxjs 7.3 and our first number is zero. Why? Because of course we have our interval and we had some values there and our first value will be zero. So according to the old way we could do something like this source to promise right and then we could get the number so if we do so um, you need to see that we also did something like take two so that again our uh, stream also get being uh, closed and we ended right and then you see also here that we get the number one because that's the last value from so if we go here and we put here something like this last value from right and i put it right here i'm gonna just to joke a little bit use three then you will see that we get one two one, uh, zero one and two and then you will see that he prints out the same thing of course we need to wait a little bit we need to wait three times two seconds right because then our stream gets been ended and then of course we get the end result and here the end result is the old way that is deprecated is two and the first number is two so if you are using rxs for example with an angular well you could uh, change the to promise to last value from because of course when you fetch something and you get a result and then the fetch is being ended well then you get that last value that comes from the api there right so that's in my opinion the best approach to do so of course sometimes you just want to have the first value of that stream and change that uh, and, and not used to promise but but just that one example would be for example translations i know that in translations we are using also rxgs and to get a translation i need to change it to to promise and i used the first value from because the first value from that stream was enough so always test it out see if that's enough and I hope you understand a little bit what the difference are between first value from, last value from, what uh, it what it is against to to promise, and what really is the equivalent of to promise versus first value or last value from. So I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you understand what I tried to explain to you in this video, and. Thank you very much for watching this video. See you next time.